All right, I will try the 40 mil off the shutter speed here. Sunny 16 now is about 11 and a half. Okay, for the floating lens, I set up to the infinity. Okay. Try the lower angle. It's all architecture since uh, the King Roma VI, I think, maybe a hundred years ago. It's a symbol like of the Nonturbury province. This clock tower is uh, was built in 1957. Set the floating lens to infinity. ไม่สวยเลยไม่ทันนะถ้ามาเถอะเพียงขาย I see the very strong lines of the metal railroad up there and against the sun in a strong perspective and look through the viewfinder by the angle and very funny The Chapaya River is the longest river from the north until to the Gulf of Thailand. The kids said, "You are a YouTuber." <laughs> Very funny. And that contrasts the temple. That's very old architecture. The buildings, some story telling the contrast. Sometimes the short telephotos or the longer telephotos may be telling story more closer and more interesting than the wide-angle lens. I saw the contrast between the modern building and old temple architectures that that does contrast it's mean uh, the old world and uh, the new world but stay together in some case that i want to get some architectures the wide angle and is sometimes is too far so the alternative to get the closer is the short left photos maybe more stunning images i will be compared with the 40 millimeters wide angle lens and uh, 150 Okay, when you switch the F lens, no need to be off the shutter speed because uh, the shutter speed is side the body. So I just set the LED F stop. The shot to the photo lens, like the 150, is more closer. The contrast between the old architecture and the modern architecture in the same place. Shot to the photos may be very useful for telling the story. The bird is coming into the frame. Yes.
the story telling to the Hasblad today is I'm trying to tell in the between the modernized and old architecture that stay together many sceneries and life for traveling transportation along the both sides of the river most very important unique and uh, 